Welcome back. Nice to talk to you again. They call me Grey Wolf. Grey Wolf means guardian of the dream time. Pretty cool name. Most Native Americans have these really, really cool names. A lot of times they're what we call pork mantle words, which are words that are put together. And it's a multisyllabic word that sounds like it's real complicated, but taken apart is something very, very simple. For instance, uh, Crazy Horse, his name when he was very young was uh, he because he has sandy colored hair and he had um, he had very very light eyes too. Later after going through ceremonies he got the distinguished name of he whose horse is crazy. I believe the pronunciation was Lakunsa Wichka but I'm not exactly sure of that because I don't speak Lakota. I just know a few phrases here and there. But what happened was when we would hang out and I do mean hang out at uh, Standing Bear's trading post, we'd have conversations in the back room. And grandfather, who was kind of like our, uh, he was our grandfather. Although he, I was older than him, but uh, he looked real craggy because he was out in the sun all the time. But he would have different, different discussions with us. And he was a very much of a fan of Socrates and Plato. And he got me into reading those uh, little writings, which is quite amazing because thousands of years ago, what they were writing was uh, compatible with today's thought. And he was talking about how Socrates would have meetings with his different children and also adults too. And he would ask questions. He'd postulate questions. And too many times we accept things for whatever they are and we don't question what it is. So essentially that's what I had in mind in creating the Native Spirit Center. I'm kind of flirting with different ideas. Uh, some ideas were to call it a Native American Cultural Center, Native Spirit Serenity Center. But it seems a lot of times when you use that word like Serenity Center, what happens is there's a lot of metaphysical people that want to do psychic readings and that type of thing. But the purpose of it really is to incorporate what's called Native Spirit into a lot of people's ideas. I'll tell you a lot more about it as we go along. Thank you.